Hello! So this video, I feel like a lot of people on YouTube are doing, is going to be uh, opening gifts that y'all have sent me because it is holiday time and some of y'all are just the kindest human beings on the planet. Uh, <laughs> and I cannot thank y'all enough, even before I open these things here, just the fact that you have given me the gift this year of y'all watching any of my videos means a lot. I was able to reach a thousand subscribers this year and I've been able to monetize this channel and both of those were goals this year and so without you I wouldn't be able to do that. So thank you. Uh, the first gift I'm going to open is from my lovely friend Second, she came over here from my Twitch stream and watches all of my YouTube content even though it has nothing to do with gaming. Um, she's just lovely. You guys have heard me mention her during my what solds because she buys from me. She's just really awesome and she sent me a gift all the way from Canada. So I'm going to open this first because this has been waiting for a while. <laughs> okay, it, it, because it came from Canada it was very well taped up. Uh, I have a note that says please read this after opening the gifts so I will do the opposite of what my parents taught me which was to read the card first and then open the gift and just set that aside. <laughs> oh my goodness! I adore you with my whole heart. She got me spicy dill pickle chips. Um, I really love pickles so much that, uh, this might gross some of you out. I will eat all the pickles and I will also drink the juice, which actually, if you didn't know, is a really good recovery drink for people that work out a lot or do a lot of running, which I used to do, but the pandemic has kind of broken me of good habits. She sent me two bags of these, so thank you so much. Uh, I'm also hungry, so... There's that. What is this? Wet pet. Wet. Oh, okay. Um, one of the videos I made was making um, a towel rack for out of a, something I thrifted for the doggos because we wipe their feet when they come in after it being wet outside. And this is one that specifically is a glove that you wear. So I will make a little loop so this goes on that. But thank you. Also, this is much easier to handle than uh, a big big towel. You wrapped all of them too! <gasps> and she got me hot sauce. So she got me scorpion sauce and habanero sauce. Thank you. I actually, um, there was a Trader Joe's like spicy chili powder. I will put a picture of it up here because I can't remember what actually the chili is that it is. Ghost pepper. There's a ghost pepper grinder. I remembered what it was um, and I put that on all of my like Mexican uh, food and curries and even like regular meatloaf because I like hot stuff. Thank you second. Oh my god. I'm trying really hard not to say her really because <laughs> I am aww. Aww. This is for Moxie. Winnipeg Jets. Uh, she's from Winnipeg. So I'm guessing this is supposed to be a cute little pillow for her to play with, which she will gladly, I'm sure, push across the floor. Thank you for including a gift for her. And I'm going to open this last since you asked me to read the note last. So I thought it was just going to be one thing. No, it's just a box of presents. And it's so. Ah! Stardew Valley on stream and she sent me the cat for Moxie and it's a pet. Oh that's so sweet. Uh, and she also sent me bubbles because oh god I'm, I'm leaking. Thank you that's so sweet. 
And there's that. I'm gonna be leaky. I shouldn't have put makeup on. I knew I should have put makeup on. Ugh. And then she sent me a hippo ornament. She sent me a hippo ornament last year. I feel like this is gonna be a thing where second is gonna send me a hippo uh, ornament every year and Cooper is going to send me a mug every year because that's what he's done for the past several years. Ugh. I literally love hippos, if you didn't know. Like, they're my favorite animal because they're pooping death tornadoes, if, if you didn't know. Wait, does this make noise? Um, why doesn't it make noise? Oh, I guess I gotta put a battery in it or do something else with it. It plays I want a hippopotamus for Christmas. Are you kidding me? Oh my goodness, yes. All right, I will make this work, not now, because uh, that's gonna take effort and I don't have any energy for effort. I barely have energy to cry right now, but thank you, Second, for the hippo and for the pen and for stuff for the babies and stuff to put in my face and now I still have to open the card and read your note and cry some more. <laughs> Meowy Christmas. Wishing you warm paws and warm hearts all around. Thank you, second. Ugh. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna read this separately because it's actually a really lengthy, lovely letter and I, I wanna give it time. And I also don't wanna cry anymore. So uh, the next item I have to segue to show you what was purchased. Uh, I, I don't really publicize this, but there is a, like a wish list down in the comments below. It's something that I use for my stream. Um, and Victoria from Super Geeked bought me something off of it, but it wasn't for me. It was, she bought Moxie something from it. So let's go let, let, let segue now. Miss um, Moxie would like to thank Victoria from Super Geek for sending her more of her delicious food. That's a thank you, by the way. Thank you, Victoria. I really appreciate it. I, I couldn't wait. Uh, I couldn't wait to open it because she had just run out of food when that arrived. It was like the most perfect timing. So Victoria, thank you very much. Moxie has been happily eating it. So thank you very much. <laughs> yeah, so Victoria, thank you very much for meaty, for feeding my needy fur baby um, and making sure that she will scream at me twice a day, every day to, to fill her bowl with the food. So thank you for that. Um, I did also receive a gift from Matt from Thrift to Life. I'm covering up his address because I don't know if he wants to share that. Uh, but he <laughs> addressed it to my book channel because he also has a book channel uh, named Booked Pilled. And uh, I also have a book channel named Bob's Books. Uh, and I think this is books for my book channel. So. But I will open this there, so I guess if you want to see what Matt from Thrift to Life sent me for my book channel, you have to go follow my book channel, because I will open that uh, on Monday, because that's when I upload. So I also cried uh, when I saw that Matt sent me something, because again, I'm a giant baby. It's just like the same thing when Tracy sent me something and I started to cry, because it's just like, I feel like those of you that are YouTubers, or just in general, when you like look up to somebody or when you like have a lot of respect and regard for somebody that is in the community that you're in. And like also as someone who didn't have friends growing up until like high school. So like my formative years, I was friendless. <laughs> so I didn't think anybody ever liked me and I still don't think people like me. <laughs> Um, so when, when people that I have a lot of regard for, you know, like Victoria and from Super Geek and, and, you know, Tracy from Tracy Parks and Tommy Bernard Show and Matt from Thrift to Life and Book Pill, they think enough of me to send me something unprompted. It means a lot. <laughs> and the fact that, because it, it feels like you're being not only confirm that they do actually like you, like the people that you like a whole lot, like you just as much. 
but it makes you feel like you know maybe i am doing something good with my channel so it's, it's just an extra push especially if you guys are sending me stuff too it's just like okay well people actually maybe do like me and that means a lot um i'm gonna i'm getting hot because <laughs> i'm getting emotional um <coughs> this next thing is from robert uh he asked me if he could send me stuff from his wife's clothing company which I will put up here and I will also put a link in the description down below as well as in a pinned comment. Um, he asked me to take a look at her clothing website first to see if I would even be interested in checking out any of the clothes and I said yes please go ahead because he's been watching my regular thrifting content but also watches my unboxings and sees how difficult it is for me to find clothing that both fits me and that I like. Um, so he sent me some and I was expecting, you know, a poly mailer with a couple of pieces and he sent this giant box <laughs> of stuff. Um, so this is from like a previous collection of his wife. He does have, uh, she does have a new collection that's out and she also apparently just sealed a distribution deal as well with a bunch of other stores. So congratulations if she's watching this. And uh, I'm very interested to see what is in here because he didn't tell me what was coming. He just said, I'm going to send you stuff that I think you'll like and that will fit. And the great thing is, as you've got seen from my video with my friend Donna, is that while Donna and I are completely different shapes and sizes, if it doesn't fit me, chances are it will fit her. And if it's something that she'll like, she'll get to keep it. Donna, if you're watching this video, um, let me know if you want any of these pieces. <laughs> so it is DG Simply Zen. And this is company. And this really cute blonde model is on the front. And it's got pictures of her. Super cute. Uh, okay. Okay. So. I'm gonna do a try on. So this is a small. I told him that based on her sizing chart, which thank goodness she has a sizing chart, that I would probably be a small. So this looks like it is a three quarter sleeve and it's gray. Y'all see how much gray I, I wear. Ooh, that looks like it would fit me. And it looks like it's got a boat neck. Cute. Oh, he sent me comfy pants. Thank you. Thank you for sending me. Oh, no, wait. This isn't comfy pants. This is a set. What? I thought they were just... I saw joggers, and I got excited because I would love some more comfy pants. I have worn my gray sweatpants to the point where, like, you can see my butt through them. That's how much I've worn them. So I'm very excited about a pair of joggers. I'm wearing joggers right now. You can't see me because I'm sitting down. Oh, this is awesome. It's got a roll tab. Oh, and it's a cardigan with, with the hood. Is this a set? Is this a set? Yeah, it's a set. Okay. What is this? I, I don't know what these are. I'm not sponsored by them. He just asked me if I wanted them. And I, of course I said yes. Oh, we got black pants. I didn't ask if he wanted me to say anything other than he's like, no, just tell me if you like it or not. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> uh, between the thrift stores and apparently Robert and his lovely wife, I am going to be set with pants. And we'll no longer need pants. Oh, this is another set. Seriously? Robert, this is a lot. I literally thought he was going to send me like two or three things. So we have a really nice cream sweater with some front pocket, with a front pocket. Oh, Jesus. And then we have a, yeah. Can you see why I looked on the website and was like, yeah, you can send me clothes. <laughs> Robert, this is too much. There's still more in here. Wait, this is purple.
so this is another hoodie this one does not have a pocket but it is high low okay and then what are these is this another top i'm gonna oh look at this color so this is a mock neck oh this is like a log and look piece okay i'm gonna have to push y'all back so i can actually like show these clothes when i try them Look, it's gray. You know, if all of these fit, which I think they kind of are, I'm gonna have to do like a closet clear out, which means I get to sell my clothes, which is fine. All right, let me uh, push y'all back and I will try some of these on. Good news is that sleeves are long enough. It fits my shoulders. Uh, unfortunately, oh, and the hood actually is a big enough hood. That's important. I almost never can find a hood that fits me. The problem is, is that while these gray pants technically fit, they are not comfortable because they're pancaking my butt because my butt's too big. My butt has gained like two inches in the last year because I've been sitting on it too much and not working out enough. Uh, I feel like people can feel me there. So, I can either work out or I can see if Donna wants these. <laughs> but I'm gonna try the black ones on and see if it's the same issue. Um, and then just put on my regular joggers if there is, but I'm gonna try on some more pieces. But this, this fits comfortable. All right, so good news. Uh, the black leggings fit. They are not high-waisted. They are kind of like a mid-rise, mid-rise high-waist depending on where your waist is. Um, I have a long torso, so it's kind of mid-rise on me, but they do fit and they don't pancake my butt. Uh, and they are long enough, so nice. Um, Tracy, if you're watching this, it's a 32 inch inseam, so it would not quite be long enough for you. But these are, these are the right size. I don't know what this is. Does it have it on here? Um, it just has a style number but yeah this oh also it has a pocket it has a pocket right here for like a card or keys or something right there which is awesome also this has pockets this has pockets <laughs> and it's also long enough to cover your bum so again i think it's a log and look type of deal uh this doesn't bother me quite as much as i thought it was going to because of how the, the garments cut the fact that it has pockets is definitely a big bonus. All right, so uh, because the gray pants don't fit, Donna, if you're watching this, if you want them, let me know and I will, I will let you have them. You can at least try them on and see if they fit you. I, I have a blue and gray piece that I thrifted that's pretty much exactly like this except blue and I wear it all the time. Um, the only thing I always wished about it was that it was longer so I could tuck it into stuff and this one is longer, so I can tuck it into stuff. And I do like how almost everything is longer in the back and shorter in the front. Also, this is, like how cute this is. I don't know if you can see it. It's like a little metal thing with the logo. But this is nice. I love kangaroo pockets. All right, I got a few more pieces. And then I'll be done. Okay, so this is the hooded waffle knit cardigan and apparently everything is three quarter lengths because of the fact that this uh, has the roll tab. Robert, please tell your wife that she's amazing for one, putting pockets on almost everything and two, making hoods actually big enough for you to use them as hoods. Amazing. So this is the cardigan Again, the hood is actually a hood for someone who's tall with a long torso and broad shoulders. This is amazing. Also, I really like the color of this. And uh, there are pockets. <laughs> oh, I love it. I'm gonna have to clear out my closet, which is fine because it's just more inventory for me to sell. I'm gonna actually have to rotate things out of my rotating reseller closet. And then this is the boat neck piece. 
with three quarter length sleeves. I feel like this thing is soft enough and big enough. I could probably wear this to sleep in. Or be like one of those things where like you wake up and look put together, but like literally this is what you slept in. I don't know how I would do with the buttons though, but this is one, one of the few pieces that doesn't have pockets. But this is very comfortable. So I got two more pieces left. This sweater, I, it's a little see-through. <laughs> That's okay. I'm pretty sure I should wear this with something. This should be an over top of something thing instead of just a by itself thing. This is cozy. Also, another reason why I agreed for him to send me all this stuff is because almost everything that I have shown you so far is made out of natural fiber. So it's either recycled cotton or uh, bamboo. So everything is at least a cotton blend, a recycled organic cotton blend. An organic cotton blend or a recycled cotton blend. Or if it's a cotton blend, most of it is with bamboo. So it is right up my alley with needing only natural fibers. So I saved the thing I was most excited for last. I will be right back. I should do like the TikTok thing where I do this, but I don't know how to do that. I'll try it here. We'll, we'll do it again, see if it works. Okay, did that work? <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, this is this tucked into a nice pair of wool pants or a nice wool skirt. Oh, so good. All right, what is this made out of? This is made out of 100% cotton. Yep. Again, perfect. Oh, and this is such a big, fluffy, floppy neck. <sighs> Robert, please hug your wife for me. She did an amazing job. And I, I cannot thank you enough for sending this to me. I'm gonna put my regular clothes back on because I'm overheating because it's not quite cold enough here in Virginia today to be wearing all this, but I'll be right back. So now that I've made a giant mess out of my dining room, thank you, Victoria, for sending Moxie food. I don't even know how you found my wish list. I know it's in there for everybody to see, but like, thank you. Um, also, second, thank you for sending me so many presents. Uh, I have to wake Moxie up to get her to be interested in the catnip toy. I will definitely read your note when I'm done filming this. Thank you for all the treats. Uh, those ships will probably not make it until the weekend. And I'm excited to try the hot sauces to see how spicy they actually are. Um, thank you so much. Uh, again, if you wanna see what Matt from Thrift to Life sent me, you're gonna have to check out my other channel or his. I think you should check out his channel. It's better, in my opinion, but that's, yeah. <laughs> and um, Robert, thank you and your wife both. Uh, I will link to DG Simply Zen, again, in a pinned comment down below. Again, this is not sponsored. He just sent me all these clothes. Uh, the only thing that didn't work out is the gray sweatpants and that's just because my butt's too dang big but uh, I'm very excited to have another pair of black leggings. I'm very excited about that and all like I said pretty much everything that is on that site it's all natural um, fiber blends maybe a couple of uh, natural fiber blends with polyester but most everything is a natural fiber blend and it's very comfy. <laughs> So you'll be seeing me wear these in future videos for sure. Uh, but thank you for watching this. Thank you everyone for sending me these things. Thank you for being a part of this year and I will see you in the next video. I haven't decided what that's gonna be yet. So it'll be a surprise to both of us. <laughs> Until then, bye. Hero, hero. Hero, hero. I wanna be a hero, hero. Oh,